Warning, what you're about to see may induce drooling and cause an uncontrollable desire to sell. Viewer discretion is advised. Introducing the most wanted spring summer lineup ever. Andy, Little Italy Carponte, wanted for stealing people's hearts. Susie, Sweet Keys Flamingo, wanted for being a master of disguise. Chef Tony the Natural Calvino, wanted for being too much of a good thing. Matt Muffins Jensen, wanted for causing a stir. And Carl Too Cool Carmichael, wanted for being too cool for his own good. Although they may look innocent, these extremely tasty products have been causing quite a racket. Each tasting so good they ought to be illegal. Thanks to you, our viewers, we have discovered the true identities of this year's spring and summer products. Most wanted. Reveal. The moment I laid eyes on Andy, I knew something was up. Buongiorno. Good morning. Arrivederci. I could tell right away that Andy was different from the others. In my heart, I knew he was special. I could see it in his eyes and I could hear it in his voice. Bella mia, has anyone ever told you you look like Sophia Loren? Oh, Andy, stop. Oh, and the way he smelled. The aroma of olive and sun-dried tomatoes. It took me away to a sun-drenched Italian countryside. <sighs> you know, I can't believe how much energy those four-year-olds have. Yeah. Bella mia. How you doing? Just fine, thanks. Buono, buono. Ciao, bella mia. He smells so heavenly. It wasn't long until I found out about the real Andy. By then, I had fallen for him completely. He was really a Tuscan Valley cheese ball mix with olives and sun-dried tomatoes. It was so simple. All I had to do was add cream cheese and roll it in the included crispy crumb coating. It was delicious, served with crackers, bagel chips, or crusty bread. I tried to keep our attraction a secret, but I knew in my heart he was too delicious not to share. Pam, you just have to try this new cheese ball mix I discovered. It's so yummy. Andy, it's Little Italy Carponzi. His true identity revealed. <laughs>